been an enjoyable season. I think we we done a good season, but like you said, it's not over, and uh, there's still games to play. We have the semi-final against Paris, and to uh, finish as high as possible in the, in the in the league. So there's still games to play, and hopefully we can finish strong. Uh, no, it's true. Like you said, uh, yeah, it's been different. Um, I remember two years ago we win uh, the the league with Juventus, and then I would join Dijon, and it's completely different. We fight for survival, and this year is uh, more positive. We fight for European place, but but yeah, like like you said, uh, there's uh, disappointment within the group, which shows that uh, we want to um, we want to push ourselves and challenge challenge for important places so it shows the mentality of the group that we're all disappointed. Uh, I mean from the beginning my idea was to bring something different to the team and I think uh, I think we've done that like you said uh, the three of us me Andy and in Gaetan we have uh, we have good st uh, statistics we score score a lot of goals and we um, assist a lot as well. So we help the team uh, massively. And I don't know. I couldn't tell you the the turning point. is is difficult to say. I mean, I think at the end of the season, when the season's finished, we can accept, uh, assess and see where where we went wrong and and what happened. But but no, I mean, we we tried. We 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 fought for the whole season and. And yeah, it's a bit disappointing, but like I said, there's still something to play for, so hopefully we can finish on the high. No, I mean, at the beginning, um, I think it was kind of, could say a kind of a blessing, you know, like I took an injury, I was out for, for a while, and then I could uh, I could sit and, and watch how uh, the team played and how them two they played, you know, and after that it was just understanding. When I got into the team, it was just understanding. Like they know uh, when I make a run or when when them they make a run, especially them two they they know each other's movements. And I feel like me, I'm still learning. So so yeah, it's just a good feeling between us. Really. Yeah, no, I, I knew the coach, he, he wanted to play this option. Uh, that's one of the reasons why he he decided to bring me to this club. So he wanted to change the dynamic of the team. And I just knew it was just uh, being patient, getting myself fully fit. And like I said, just learning, you know, uh, just learning, bringing another dimension to the team. And yeah, I think um, us three have done a, a good season so far. I think yeah, from Monaco because the ankle injury is a bit, it's different because you have to be very careful. Sometimes it can, uh, if you take a wrong step or you miss hit a football, it can, it can go. So for me, I had to be very careful. Even when I was back, I had to to protect myself. So yeah, I feel like yeah, you could say after the Monaco game, it was a big uh, stepping stone for me, like a boost of confidence. And then yeah, the rest. Uh, the rest I wasn't worried about because I knew uh, my time will come, so... Yeah, yeah it's, it's, it's bizarre because, uh, of course, I joined a new club and, you know, I want to be with the fans, and but I haven't had the opportunity to to, to, to yet play in front of the fans, especially in, in our stadium. So, yeah, it's... Hopefully next season we can uh, that will allow the fans uh, into the stadium and, and we can uh, have some good make some good memories next season with the fans. No, it's difficult because normally uh, uh, I always have friends and family who come to visit me often, but this year is, is difficult for my mom, my brother, my family, my friends to to come over and spend some time with me. So 
uh, me I had to adapt to let everyone else but you know it's, it's a life and you just have to move on and, and wait for better days to come. I don't know, I feel like the difference between this year and last year is that obviously now I play in a better team, so now I have more opportunities and when opportunities they come it's just up to me whether to take the opportunities or or not. So I feel like I understand uh, the football here in France, I like it a lot, it's very quick and yeah I think I've adapted well. The positive one, I don't know, I have, uh, I have two in my head, I have uh, the game against Lille and where I feel like we, we could have won the game, I feel like we could have won the game, I feel like I could have had penalty at the end, but it showed how, how good we are, we're playing, uh, showing our quality against a team that's at the top of the table and another game, obviously I'm going to say Ren because I scored two goals and I make a penalty, but no, a disappointing game for me is uh, the game against Nice. I think it, it really damaged us and it's very disappointing because we didn't play to our maximum ability and, and it was a important game for us. No, yeah, like you said, I had the opportunity to make it 2-1 and maybe this had changed the dynamic of the whole game but like, like I said before the opportunity when I get opportunities is down to me and unfortunately I missed this opportunity and, but if I scored this opportunity maybe the whole game would change but you know it's just one of those uh, those things it comes and it goes so fast but yeah no we were, like you said we was close and it just shows how good we are as a team we can uh, compete against these top teams. Yeah, no, we're all excited, uh, the players, the staff, the coach, we're all excited, of course it's a big game, these are the games you want to play in, so yeah, we're all excited and uh, we're going to give everything that we can. When you watch them, it's always it's enjoying to watch because they have a lot of good players, but then again, at the end of the day, it's, uh, it's one match, 11 against 11, so we just have to, we have to be there, we have to be ready. Yeah, I mean, it's, it's no, it's good. It just it shows how um, it shows obviously how everyone that knows that the Premier League is, is is the best league, and yeah, no, it's is it's yeah, it's exciting. I mean, you have potentially another two teams in Europa, like Arsenal and Manchester, so it could be an all English European fan. Yeah, <laughs> that would be the perfect season. <laughs>